From afar, our sun appears as a serene, radiant yellow sphere. However, in reality, it is a tumultuous ball of incredibly hot plasma. Deep within its core, the light and warmth we feel daily result from the vigorous process of nuclear fusion occurring at the surface, specifically in the first visible layer, known as the photosphere. Matter rises and churns akin to a boiling cauldron, accompanied by the emergence of a peculiar wind from the sun. This wind, known as the solar wind, is far from a gentle breeze. Rather, it resembles the intense howl of a hurricane. The solar wind consists of plasma, a form of superheated, electrically charged gas forcefully expelled from the sun in all directions throughout the solar system. A continuous flow of highly charged material emanates from the sun at a rate of approximately 2 million tons per second. This stream traverses the solar system, engaging with any obstacles in its path, including other planets. One notable manifestation of its interaction with Earth is the spectacular aurora above the polar regions. Yet witnessing the solar wind in our skies is not the sole means of encountering this potent solar phenomenon. Thanks to the unprecedented exploration by the Parker Solar Probe, we now have the opportunity to not only see, but also hear the solar wind. The audio clips you are about to hear don't represent sound as we perceive it on Earth, as space lacks a medium for sound transmission. However, the data collected by the Parker Solar Probe shares certain similarities with terrestrial sound. The probe measures pressure waves within the particles, constituting the solar wind. In our daily lives, we perceive pressure waves as sound. By analyzing the frequencies and amplitudes of these pressure waves within the solar wind, scientists can convert the data into audio clips for us to hear. The sounds you're about to experience, resembling washing and whistling noises, originate from the pressure waves generated by the hot, electrically charged plasma emanating from the sun's wispy outer layers. Among the six upcoming audio clips, the initial two are particularly peculiar, in my view. Let's listen to each clip, and afterward, I'll provide additional information about the specific phenomena we are hearing before proceeding to the next one. These somewhat disconcerting audio recordings are known as Whistler mode waves, and they result from pressure waves caused by energetic electrons erupting from the sun's corona, the outermost part of the sun's atmosphere. These electrons trail along magnetic field lines extending from the sun into the farthest reaches of the solar system, revolving around them in a manner akin to riding a carousel. When the frequency of a plasma wave aligns with the rate at which these electrons spin, mutual amplification occurs. To our ears, this amplification manifests as a tumultuous or even a shrieking hurricane. The subsequent audio clip is less unsettling, but equally otherworldly. This audio recording originated from a Langmuir wave, akin to Whistler waves, but characterized by very high frequency pressure waves. When translated into sound, these waves produce an almost ethereal, high-pitched sensation. Following this, we will listen to two clips, each featuring peculiar chirps, squeaks, or frequencies. These distinctive chirping sounds arise from dispersive waves swiftly transitioning from one frequency to another as they traverse the solar wind. 
these frequency shifts generate a chirping effect, reminiscent of wind rushing over a microphone. Initially considered inconsequential by scientists studying near-Earth regions, these waves were later discovered to be pervasive closer to the sun, with the cause remaining unknown. The final audio recording is equally captivating, but distinct from the previous five. Unlike the sound of hot plasma waves, this one captures the microscopic impacts of dust colliding with the probe's sensitive instruments, resembling the static of an old TV. What you're hearing is the audio representation of countless tiny impacts, where dust, particles from asteroids and comets, torn apart by the sun's immense gravity and heat, collide with the spacecraft at speeds approaching half a million kilometers per hour, equivalent to over a quarter of a million miles per hour. Each collision signifies the disintegration of dust, chipping away small fragments of the spacecraft. By listening to plasma waves, similar to those featured in this video, scientists endeavor to unravel some of the sun's most profound mysteries, such as the reason behind the sun's corona being hotter than its surface, and the origin of the high energy of particles in the solar wind. For those of us who aren't engaged in unraveling these intriguing mysteries, experiencing the peculiar sounds of our nearest star is truly remarkable. I trust you found this video enjoyable. If so, please tap the like button, subscribe, and remember to activate your notification bell to stay updated on our uploads. Thank you all for watching.